Are you okay? Kim? You're gonna be all right, boo. I could terminate her. Come on, I'm not gonna let that happen. I'm worried about Tim. I'm not worried about Lucy. I'm not sure we're the right team for that assignment. Knock it off. The fierce protector. I was trying to protect you. What? I wouldn't have gotten the stupid plaque if you didn't have my back today. You project the rogue cop thing, but you are always on the right side of the lot. I see that proof that you're a survivor. If you need me, let me know. Yeah, time machine. I was standing this close to the guy. I wish I did. But I never saw him coming. This is okay? Okay. It wasn't your day of death. It was the first day of the rest of your life. You saved yourself. Thanks. Thanks. You know me so well. Too well. You showed humanity. There's nothing to feel guilty about. What happened wasn't your fault. When I was in that barrel, I knew you would find me. The book's out of print. There's no audio book. Yeah, which is why I recorded one for you. I told Gray that I'm not interested in moving up just yet. Tim Bradford finishes what he starts. And I am responsible for a life that is in jeopardy. I would do whatever I have to to save her. I know you'll help me. Yeah, it's not really part of my job description. Tim? Thanks. Thanks. For what? For what? Doing my job? Doing my job. Mm-hmm. We're friends. <laughs> Read by the best rookie you've ever trained. Been here all night. I'm proud of you. You did good. Twenty bucks for your boot makes it out on top. I'll take that bet. She's saying she can handle herself. I know she can. Because I know you can handle it.